This is called Garden of the Gods. It's like the only place in the area that has rock formation like this. It just sticks out the ground. Like a formation of rock that occurred. And there's like red, there's like one white one, and the rest of this red. And like if you look everywhere else, it's mountain range. I think it's nice. It's like one of those things that you do once in a lifetime, it's worth it. Um, it's definitely more uh, hiking trails and staircase, but. I got it in the gods. It's nice that all the hiking trails are paved and so interesting to see like all this like natural stuff. It's nice. I still don't get it. Why is there? I guess we should have looked at the depth wall. Oh, there's a map. Yeah, this is a little nicer than when we went to um, San Francisco. It's very interesting how it just like sticks out the map. But you can see all the cars. So if you park in the parking lot over there. We'll take that road. I got it in the gods. It's nice that all the hiking trails are paved and makes it easier for all the people who want to see it. And... Oh, you can see houses from here. Heck. It's so pretty though. Like the idea that everything else is mountain range and flat. And then all these like rock formation just comes out of the ground. And sticks out like a sword thumb. Ever seen these trees before? Like, I've seen bushes before, but never with wherever these things are. The short hike, maybe like half mile, not even. One other way to get to Pikes Peak is so it's to take here. It's the like Cog Railway. Um, it started off down oh, by... So We're like eye level while the clouds. Can you see that? <laughs> At the top, you can see the multiple different types of cities, um, including uh, Manitou Spring and Colorado Springs and all the, some of the small towns surrounding that area as well. Because we're so high up, um, there was not a lot of oxygen that um, even my blood level in oxygen is very low. I did feel lightheaded, slightly nauseous. We are at uh, something Seven Falls. Beautiful seven layer waterfall thing. <laughs> this is actually quite cool. What? There's, we're in, cave, in a cave. This is literally a cave. Okay. The cool thing is there's a Okay, but you can take the stair next to the fall to get to the top of the waterfall. Um, sadly, we didn't go all the way to the top because it was too slippery. Instead, we took the elevator to the Eagle's Outlook, which oversees the waterfall and the surrounding valley. The hike to the waterfall is very short. It's only 0.5 miles, in my opinion. Mm, they say about 0.7 for most people. Um, if you or don't want to walk, there is a, a shuttle you can take. Uh, we're doing the Manitou's incline. You can literally see it from here. To do the Manitou incline, you have to get a permit. We haven't even got to the base yet. It's just the entrance. <sighs> for sure. It's pretty hot today. And it's funny because today is actually not a really hot day. It's over at 7 Maybe we should stretch before we go in. It's not over here. It's kind of nice, I guess. Not crowded. It's only been five minutes. It's like doing the steps of the gym for five minutes. We went to the Hawaii one. There was no shade. Uh, make sure to get plenty of water and stretch prior to going to the incline. Um, make sure you also have extra uh, water as well and sunscreen. Very important. There's no station at the top, so whatever you bring, water you bring, that's all you have. We are going to Bear Lake. Um, we had to get a separate permit to get into this section of the park for the Pacific Lake. So let's go check it out. It's actually slightly warmer than Lake Michigan in early spring. So it's not that big. You can literally see the whole lake. Look at this. Look at this. 
Is it axolotl? <laughs> no, it's so cool. You got to see something cool. This grass is growing from the water. It grows up and then once it reaches the surface, it just like flats. It's a good thing we did this route instead of this, the other route. They're from Bear Lake, we also took a hike to get to Alberta Hall. Okay. Trees have eyes. Kind of creepy though. It's like creepy and pretty at the same time. Because the tree has eyeballs. They're all staring at you. There's a waterfall. Oh, cool. Okay. Oh. That's very cool. Oh, yeah. Oh, um, I would much prefer a more natural one. We enjoyed our time in Colorado. Um, given that the climate is very, very hot and dry, there's very little lake around and any lake around it's non-swimmable mostly just for fishing we look forward to visiting colorado again